All right. Yeah, I guess, I don't know. Part of me, I guess I just want to articulate for myself as well. Um, probably you know, for other people because I don't, I'm hoping that things will go uh, well for the rest of the week and also for Saturday for the live stream. I've been having some interesting computer issues. The way there it's acting though, I'm thinking it's a power supply issue um, because all of a sudden it'll reboot or whatever, or it'll have a, a hard time. Anyways, I'm just thinking, okay, the, to me, it seems like a, a power supply issue. And I can remember way back when I think I was um, thinking to myself, God, you're kind of pushing it already with um, adding that extra graphics card so you could do the live streams and so on and so forth. And now I've got like three webcams popped, uh, connected to it. I mean, all of these things add up. It's not, uh, you know, you think, oh, whatever. But uh, they start, out, and I've got a scanner, and I'm like, okay, maybe, you know, I'll, I'll try that first and see what happens. But also, I mean, you know, my different schedule with non-game related stuff right now is, you know, throwing things a bit out of kilter for me, uh, focus-wise. And I think part of at the beginning, um, I knew this was going to happen, and I kind of jumped the gun a little bit in the sense that I did prepare some stuff for the live stream. Like, I have all my chronology written out. Um, there, uh, okay. I haven't taken notes on the African, uh, um, the great war in Africa chapter two, uh, for the Cameroons, uh, yet, but, uh, it's kind of like still there. I've done a ton of work uh, as far as I'm concerned on the second battle of Ypres. Still have a bit more to do, but, uh, most of the, most of the information like to incorporate it into Dervel Craig's done. So I'm really darn happy with that. Um, and then it, you know, yet again, it's like, okay, I do have to go back into, you know, focusing on that stuff. But uh, hold on, I just want to move my hand. Yeah, I just wanted to move my hand without going uh, crazy jerky or whatever and drive people nuts. Um, what else? I was trying to think of like game design or whatever. And I was thinking, you know, uh, with can, uh, can games coming up and Kirk D uh, uh, a few days ago mentioning in a, uh, one of the comments of, uh, oh, are you, uh, because I was doing counters thinking, oh, are you designing a game? I was like, no, no. But... Um, if I was, I'm just saying often delusional alternate reality land or whatever, um, I would love to do a, a game system. Um, and yeah, I know you could say, oh, wait a minute. There's a, dr a trillion of them already out there that way. I know, I know, I know. Um, I'd like to do something such as a trilogy of trilogies, if that makes any sense. I have three uh, games out there uh but each game would have three scenarios and i'm trying to model it something in the way of uh, gev or jev or gev or whatever the heck you want to call it the old uh metagaming uh the sequel to uh, ogre which i just absolutely adore i love gev um and i, I so i'd want to do something like that I'll also like try to be able to bang out let's say two to three games in four hours uh with a friend in an afternoon so that way you could switch sides and also maybe have a tiebreaker That'd be kind of nice. Also be able to incorporate, uh, have it uh, flexible enough so uh, it could be, you know, played at a convention. That'd be nice. Um, and also have those three scenarios. Uh, yet again, you could maybe incorporate them uh, into a campaign. Um, um, so I was thinking, and yet again, and like some later on, if you wanted to do some kind of crazy monster one later on, you could, but I would want to have it. So something, maybe some, let's say early war, mid war, late war. Gee, I wonder what war. Um, and then maybe three fronts, you know, uh, and then of course, maybe those fronts would change. Maybe the mid war one would be different than the, like, for example, or the late one. Maybe you, you would have, you wouldn't no longer have uh an Eastern Front late late war one. Maybe it would be different ones. Uh, maybe it'd be Italian and Western and uh, Ottoman. You know, and the middle one would be uh, Western, Italian, Eastern. Who knows? I'm just saying. I'm just, like I said. I'm just off in Wonderland here, thinking about stuff. And sorry if I'm jerky, worky, whatever. But uh, yeah, I just man, this has just been a. Uh, what a just an amazing, fantastic ride to be uh, interacting with. Uh, I just never in a bazillion years when I was like, okay, let's start. Uh, you know, I wanted to, like I said, during the pandemic and whatnot, like uh, just get into other whatever. So I was like, the rate I paint and whatever with miniatures, I was like, okay, you're going to have to get into board gaming. And then tra la 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 la, you guys show up out of nowhere. Well, out of YouTube, of course. But uh, thank you for that. Anyways, yeah. So there we go. Okay, off I go again. See ya.